Hey guys, how you doing? Corey here from Mixing Up Outdoors off the YouTube channel. Hey, uh, today is November 11th, I believe. And uh, got up this morning. We have a little pond slash overflow ditch thing in the back here. Uh, and it is covered in ice. So uh, it won't be long. We'll be getting these babies out and uh, jigging it up. So uh, really looking forward to that. Until then... Um, Trying to get some stuff ready for deer hunting. I've uh, been doing a little bit of bull hunting. My son shot a really, really nice uh, mainframe 8. Um, had a split brow tie on it. And then I uh, had two little kickers. So actually came out to be a, um, a nice nice 11 pointer. Uh, took that to the taxidermy um, for him. And uh, excited to get that one back. But uh, we... Uh, the pre piece of property that we're gun hunting this year, um, I personally haven't been able to do much hunting. I've had some uh, medical issues going on and uh, haven't been able to get out and do a whole lot. So um, I'm going to go out and there's a tower that we built a few years ago. Um, and I think the I was out there last week, I think it was, and uh, I noticed the roof was kind of sagging in on it and stuff. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw the four-wheeler on the trailer and uh, hook it up to the truck and go out there and see what we can figure out. Um, the stand itself is on a marsh and uh, so I'm going to try to blaze some trails through the marsh and stuff. They just cut the cornfield. Um, actually, it, it's a absolutely perfect, uh, perfect afternoon to be out bull hunting, but I just got done with the doctor and stuff and uh, it probably wouldn't be a good idea for me to go try to sit in a stand. <laughs> So I'm going to run out there and, and try to get some of that stuff done, but uh, I figured what the heck, I'll make a video here quick and uh, I'm going to run out there and and uh, just kind of show you um, the layout and um, show you, you know, the stand and stuff like that. And See anything crawling around in there? What do we got going on here? Anything in here? I don't see anything. Bees falling out. Good size hornet's nest up in here.
I know it's pretty cold, but get that out of there. Get that out of there. Get that Jesus, look at that, holy scared the shit out of me, I don't know if you guys seen that or not, but <laughs> that little mouse just come flying out of there, scared the hell out of me, better check and see if there's any more, <laughs> apparently we got a mouse nest in here, and now he's up on the ceiling, <laughs> Holy Christ, did that scare me. Alright guys, so here's from looking up in the stand here. Just kind of giving you a peek at the marsh. Um, that way, way out past that single tree there is, uh, there's a public actually that kind of loops through there. And then uh, if I turn this here, I'll try to turn it without it getting it too jittery, but I don't know how I'm going to be able to do it. Fold up this tripod here. All right, and then uh, out here, as you can see, there's a cut cornfield. Um, he actually just trimmed a few. He had a couple combines wide of corn that I was hoping he was going to leave up, but I guess he, uh, I guess he decided to cut it. So back in the corner here, past these trees, there's another group of trees back there. Um, that's what we call a buck stand for bow hunting. Um, that's where we shoot all the bucks out of. Correction, that's where my son shoots all the bucks out of. <laughs> what I'm going to do here is I'm going to set this camera up. Try to get it as close to the window as I can here. My objective, I guess you could call it, is I'm going to try and run trails. I'm going to run one probably out toward them trees there and I'm going to run one out toward this tree here. Um, the deer seems like they hit these trees a lot. Um, so that's kind of nice and then uh, I'll probably go off this way where you won't see and stuff and then maybe that way a little bit. Just a, just a couple nice little wide trails I'm going to knock down and uh, you know get some get some more options I guess
time shoe there I wouldn't make it This ain't good guys. Well guys, uh, I'm out here on the field in the marsh and uh, I don't know if you can hear me when I was driving but she's a little wetter than I thought it was and uh, well this is where I'm set right now. <laughs> she is buried, buried and I can't do it myself. I've got some bad back issues going on right now. And there's no way. So I got my kid on the way. He's got about a half an hour drive. There goes a the deer. Yep, nice deer. Nice buck, nice buck. Ah, oh, he's in the corn. I don't know if you could, I don't, I don't think I caught him on camera. Nice buck though. All right, guys, I'm about an hour in. Luckily, I had these M&Ms in my pocket. <laughs> Sitting out here waiting for my kid. I got a soda with me, too, but I'll show you that. That's my soda. <laughs> Ma'am. It is windy, it is cold, I am soaking wet, my gloves are saturated with mud, and I probably got another half hour to 45 minutes before my kid gets out here. Still waiting guys, 
It's getting colder. This is what she is. She is buried. The tires are actually off the ground, so. And, and it's deep. I mean, watch this. <laughs> and that's, that's not in the roots, our ruts. I stuck, stuck in the ruts, man. She's, she goes down pretty far in here. My savior's here. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully his big strong butt can get me out of here. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if all that weight lifting paid off. <laughs> well, I'll get back to you when he gets here. Here he comes to save dead day. Austin Clark is on his way. I hope you wore waders. Do you wear waders? Yeah. Good. Smart boy. Yeah, very wet. We got her. The young buck got her. <laughs> Look at that hole we're in over here. We ended up taking this tree, sticking that underneath one of the tires, getting the back of the trailer underneath another one. And we got her. <laughs> it's muck, just muck. Okay, I just got home here. I don't know if I captured it on video before, but uh, when I was up in the stand, a mouse came out. Well, then me and Austin crawled back up and another one come out. So I grabbed our garbage bucket from last year and just brought it home here and dumped it in the garbage bin. There's two in that bottle. You can see them in there? And there was the other one back here. There's another one there. Hey, little guy. Come on out. There's that one there. Mama's on the bottom.